Okay, everybody, welcome to part 84 of my blank DVD collection. Previously, I showed you all the first five Police Academy films. And on this disc, we have the sixth Police Academy film. And we also have The Marrying Man, Brazil, and The Breakfast Club. I have shown The Breakfast Club on a previous blank DVD before, but that was uh, when it was recorded off of AMC, when it was edited for television. This version of The Breakfast Club is its original version, and it, I recorded it off Cinemax back in 2008. So this is uncut right here. And once again, I made another mistake. I said that the seventh Police Academy film was a made-for-TV movie, Turns out it was a theatr it was a theatrical release, but a very limited theatrical release at that. But I digress. Anyway, we have one Warner Brothers movie on here. We have one Hollywood Pictures, and we have two Universal Pictures. So in the meantime, let's go ahead and take a look and see how each movie opens on their respective channels. Police Academy Six. I want to say was a um. I want to say it was a more max recording, but I could be wrong. Marrying Man, I know, was Encore. Breakfast Club, I know, was Cinemax. Brazil, I'm pretty sure, was HBO Comedy. So let's look at Police Academy 6. It was a more max recording, I remember correctly. City Under Siege. It's a 1989 comedy in which Bubba Smith and David Graff appear in this movie, as does Michael Winslow. Yeah, they made a lot of Police Academy movies. Some of the sequels I thought were unnecessary, and this one is one of them. She comes all the way to ruin our Christmas and... And what was beyond more Max that evening? Million Dollar Baby, I have it. Conspiracy Theory, I have. Turn the TV down. And of course, this movie is rated PG. Well, actually, I'm just gonna mute the TV for mild violence, P rated PG for mild violence, because the Police Academy theme plays over the Warner Brothers logo, in which this Warner Brothers logo is plastered. They plastered the 1992 Warner Brothers logo over the original. But it is what it is. Anyways, let's look at The Marrying Man. Recorded off of Encore. The following picture is rated R. The Marrying Man is rated R, of course, for adult content, adult language, and violence. And one interesting thing about The Marrying Man is the same person who directed The Brave Little Toaster four years earlier, Jerry Rees, directed this film, which I found very interesting. Here's your Hollywood Pictures logo right there. Very cool logo. Let's look at Brazil. HBO comedy recording with Jonathan Price, Robert De Niro, and Catherine Hellmond, in which Catherine Hellmond passed away not so very long ago. To me, she was best known for playing Mona on Who's the Boss. Here's your HBO comedy ident there. And then you're going to have the feature presentation. One interesting thing about the movie Brazil is that here in the, uh, domestically, Universal owned the rights to this film, whereas internationally, 20th Century Fox owned the rights to this film. I found that very interesting, to say the least. And Brazil, of course, is rated R for violence and adult language, and that's it. And then here comes the Universal Pictures logo. So Universal owned the film, owned the domestic rights, whereas 20th Century Fox owned the international rights to this film. I found that very interesting, to say the least. All right, let's look at The Breakfast Club. Bland Cinemax titles there. Bland Cinemax graphics, I mean. Emilio Estevez, Anthony Michael Hall, and Judd Nelson are in this film. Oh, this is a five-star Max recording. Okay. The Breakfast Club, American Beauty, and The Devil Wears Prada. I only have The Breakfast Club, and that's it. So this is a five-star Max recording. My bad. And The Breakfast Club is rated R. Yeah, your bland, bland graphics. For adult content and adult language, presented in high definition, 
Now, the film Don't You Forget About Me by Simple Minds plays. The theme, opening theme of that song plays over the Universal Pictures logo. That's why I have the TV muted. So that way I don't get a copyright I claim or an ID, copyright ID match. And there you go for part 84 of my Blake DVD collection. Part 85 will be up soon. I'll see you all for the next video coming soon.